Hello, welcome to Creator Classes. I am Gurmeet Singh. In this lecture, we will cover the surface area and volume of cuboid and cube. This lecture is part of the complete series on volume and surface area of 3D solids. So let's begin the lecture. So let's begin with cuboid. Cuboid is a 3D object which is having the six faces and a base of a cuboid is a rectangle. So we can say cuboid is formed from the six rectangle. The six faces of a cuboid are six rectangle. Let's understand this with a case. Let's take a rectangle. The same we have covered in the previous lecture also. Every 3D object is formed from a 2D object. Here the base of the cuboid is a rectangle. So let's take a rectangle. If we keep on adding the similar rectangle over this rectangle, a 3D object will be formed. This 3D object is known as cuboid. If you observe, these are the six faces of the cuboid. The cuboid is having three components that is length, width and the height. Let's denote the length as L, width as B and the height as H. Okay. Here as I have told it is formed from the six rectangle. So can we calculate the area of this rectangle? In the basic 2D geometry we have seen the formula of the rectangle. What it is? It is length into width. So we can calculate area of all these six rectangle with the help of the formula that is length into width. Let's see. Area of this will be equal to L into B. This will be H into B. This will be L into H. This will be L into B. This will be H into B. This will be L into H. So what we have done? We have used the formula that is area of the rectangle is length into width. We got area of all the six faces. So can we calculate the surface area of this rectangle? The surface area of the rectangle is equal to area of the total surface. Here for the cuboid, the surface area is the area of the six rectangle that is the six faces of this cuboid. So we can calculate the surface area of this rectangle by adding area of all these six rectangle that is six faces of the cuboid. Let's do so. On adding, we got the formula of surface area of the cuboid, which is twice of L into B plus B into H plus H into L. Got the point? This is the formula of the surface area of the cuboid. Okay. So we got the surface area of the cuboid. Moving further, let's calculate the lateral surface area. This is a new term. Lateral surface area, it means the surface area of the object without the top and the bottom face. Got it? Lateral means only the lateral surface will be covered. We will not cover the surface area of top and the bottom face. For this cuboid, the lateral surface area will be the surface area of only the lateral faces. Means we will ignore the area of top and the bottom face. We will not consider the area of the top and bottom face. Only the area of the lateral faces will be covered. Let's see. So let's only take the area of the lateral faces. So we got twice of L into H plus twice of B into H. Okay, so we got the lateral surface area as twice of L into H plus B into H. This is the formula of the lateral surface area of the cuboid. Again, no need to mug up this formula. Just you should know the basic concept that is what is surface area and what is the lateral surface area. Once you know the basic fundamental and you know the basic formula of area of the 2D shape, then you can find the surface area of any 3D shape. So my advice is not go into the detail of mugging of the formula. Just understand the basic fundamental. You will be able to solve any question in the examination. Let's take a small question. The question is the dimension of the cuboid is length is 15 centimeter, width is 10 centimeter, height is 20 centimeter. Find the surface area and the lateral surface area. Okay. So all the three dimension that is length, width and height is given. We know the formula of the surface area of the cuboid that is twice of L into B plus B into H plus H into L. Let's put the value and let's solve it. 
we got the surface area of this cuboid as 1300 cm square. Got it? Further, this question is also asking for the lateral surface area. Means we have to exclude the surface area of top and the bottom face. We got the lateral surface area as twice of L into H plus B into H. Okay, let's put the value and let's solve it. We got our answer as 1000 cm square. Got the point? Surface area of the cuboid is the total area of the six faces of the cuboid. And lateral surface area is the total area of the lateral faces of the cuboid. We are excluding the top and the bottom face. Let's move further to our next topic that is the volume of the cuboid. We have seen that cuboid is formed by adding the rectangles. We have taken the base as a rectangle and we have keep on adding the congruent rectangles to form the final shape as the 3D cuboid. So basically the base form of the cuboid is the rectangle. We have added the rectangle up to the height of H and the dimension of a rectangle is L into B. Now we have to calculate the volume of this cuboid. That is we have to calculate how much space is this cuboid is taking. Here the space this cuboid is taking is equal to the space all these rectangles are taking. So can we say volume of this cuboid is equal to the area of the base into the height up to which we have added this rectangle. That is area of the base into H. H is the height of this cuboid. And here area of the base that is area of the rectangle is L into B. So we can say the final volume of a cuboid is L into B into H. That is the volume of the cuboid. Okay. What we have done? We have taken the area of the base and we have multiplied it with the height of the cuboid. The height up to which we have added the congruent rectangle. Got the point? The same fundamental will be applicable in all the 3D cases where we have added the congruent bases. Here our base is a rectangle. We have added the congruent rectangle. If we change the base, the formula will change. For example, if we take a circle in place of a rectangle, then our formula will change. That we will see in the cylinder portion. Okay. So for now, we got the volume of a cuboid is equal to L into B into H. So if we know all the three components, that is length, width and height of a cuboid, we can find the volume of the cuboid. Let's take a small example to show the implementation of the formula. Here we have to find the volume of a cuboid whose length is 15 cm, width is 10 cm and height is 20 cm. We are having L as 15, B as 10 and H as 20. And we have to find the volume of this cuboid. So directly applying the formula, that is volume is equal to length into width into height. Let's put the value and let's solve it. We got the answer that is the volume of the cuboid. Okay. So we have done with the surface area and the volume of a cuboid. Let's move to our next 3D shape that is cube. Cube and cuboid both are similar to each other. Cube is a type of cuboid in which all the dimension are same. That is in the cuboid we have seen the dimensions as length, width and height. In the case of cube, length, width and height will be equal to each other. Let's assume L, B and H is equal to A. So we got length, width and height as A. And all the other things will be similar to cuboid. That is formula of the surface area, formula of the lateral surface area and the formula of the volume. Everything will be same, just we have to replace L, B and H with the A. In the cuboid, we have seen the base as a rectangle. In the cube, the base is a square. And we know the sides of a square are equal. That is, all this six face of a cube will be square with the same dimension as A. Here the dimension of all these squares will be equal to A. Okay. So let's find the surface area of this cube. We know this is the formula of surface area of a cuboid. Let's replace L, B and H with A. We got the surface area of the cube as 6 times A square. Okay, this is the formula of the surface area of the cube. Similarly, we can find the lateral surface area. This is the formula of lateral surface area of the cuboid. Let's replace L, B and H with A. 
we got the formula of little surface area of a cube as 4a square. Similarly, can we calculate the volume? We know the volume of a cuboid is L into B into H. So let's replace it with A. We got the volume of a cube as A cube. Okay, got it. These are the formula of the cube. The difference between the cuboid and cube is that cuboid base is a rectangle and cube base is square. All the sides of a cube are same that is L, B and H are A and the sides of cuboid is length, width and height. That may be same and that may be different. So that's for this video. Thank you very much and best of luck for the exam you are preparing for. Note that this is the series on volume and surface area of various 3D solids. So best of luck and have a great day. Bye for now.